I want to be the kind of ancestor who encourages, engages, educates, uplifts, and enlightens the next generation to cross the bridge that I'm helping to build for a sustainable future for all. I want to be an ancestor who's cultivated hundreds of community organizers. I hope my organizing values and practices will still live on even without me. No matter who we are or what we have been through, I want to be an ancestor who reminds us of the visionaries and one of the most powerful forces of liberation, change, and ending the corruption and the racism. What kind of an ancestor would I be? You know, I guess my daughter and her children are going to uh, uh, maybe someday find my Wikipedia entry or uh, uh, Google search me and uh, the first many results that come up are going to involve a man I'd rather not be associated with uh, and certainly uh, I wish uh, 68 women whose names I know had not had their lives ruined by this man I'd prefer uh, those searches to turn up uh, that I celebrated the power of music to change people for the better and through those people to change the world for the better. And uh, I was kind. I want to be the type of ancestor that is remembered for breaking the cycles of alcohol and substance abuse. Breaking the cycle of violence against women and molestation amongst children. I want to be remembered as the ancestor that reinforces values like freedom, faith, integrity, education, patience, compassion, and lastly, self-love. I hope to be an ancestor who inspires future generations and who has left the world a better place through my service to others. I want to be an ancestor that is a whispering ear in the time of need. The MOM Project has a goal to directly elevate 10,000 women of color by providing full scholarships for her to upskill with highly sought after certifications. Girls Like Me Project hopes to reconnect legions of black girls to their inherent power through storytelling, historical context, research, training, and thought leadership. <laughs>